Hi, my name is William Gonitz, founder of Evolution Hair Loss Institute and Advanced Trichology. Today I really want to talk to you about the iGrow laser. Uh, we have been using the iGrow laser now since 2011 uh, for many of our at-home programs. And quite frankly, I think the iGrow laser doesn't get as much credit as it deserves because uh, it has a limited number of diodes and LEDs and there are other devices out there boasting 272 diodes or 224 diodes and more diodes certainly is not the be all and end all. So today the iGrow is probably the most well recognized device in the industry. It is a, obviously a helmet device for hair regrowth uh, it operates with exactly 21 diodes and 30 LEDs. The 21 diodes is actually a good number for people who are just beginning to lose hair or individuals with dark coarse hair and those individuals who have not been losing hair for a long period of time. Basically, if you're losing hair for less than five years, you have dark coarse hair or even a lot of uh, sort of brown or medium brown hair uh, and again, just beginning to lose it, this is a great device because you don't need a tremendous amount of stimulation to get hairs growing. You need the right amount of stimulation. So I compare in many cases to getting the right amount of energy to like hitting a baseball or hitting a golf ball. It's not more power. It's basically hitting the sweet spot and getting the optimal amount of energy to produce a result. And the iGrow is great for producing that, I'd say probably about 70% of the time. So this device basically has uh, a support system of s small suction cups up top, four of those, which actually just basically keep it suspended off of the scalp. There are also these little earmuffs, which really are for stability more than anything else. You can't actually listen to music through them, uh, but most of the time people are using them for stability. There are actually five settings on here, three men's settings, and uh, two women's settings. I usually only recommend the maximum settings and then allow people to dial back the time as usual. The average person, I recommend to use 20 minutes twice weekly to start. Then normally after 90 days, you can increase it to 25 minutes twice weekly. And then if after a year or so, you have used it and really haven't had optimal results, or have had optimal results and you need to take it up a notch and you take it up to three times weekly. I've used this protocol in conjunction with all of our products very, very successfully and it is the most FDA approved laser, meaning iGrow has two FDA clearances, one for men, one for women, based upon their own research. This is totally unique to every other at-home device that is a helmet. So this is based upon their own clinical research, their own evidence that it works, and quite frankly, after using it in practice for nearly five years now, I know it works, it's what I recommend continuously. So when you're using this, it's very, very simple. You simply power this on, simply hit this uh, little power button, and then you will touch one of the heads, either a male or female. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the male, which is gonna turn this on for 25 minutes. The lights are illuminated. There is a static beam and there's a pulsing beam going on in this. So these are going to provide different levels of stimulation. Additionally, when you're done, it simply turns off, which is a very nice feature of this. It is wired, so obviously you need to be near a power outlet. But again, this device, in my opinion, for about 70% of the people who use it, especially those with dark hair and dark skin, um, but also those who have not been losing hair for a long period of time, definitely less than five years, uh, they will do very, very well with this device, and I always stress it to be used in conjunction with all the right products, uh, such as our products, uh, particularly we have many kits that have the iGrow laser in it so that all of that can be used successfully. So please, when you're choosing your laser device, know that more is not better. You need the optimal amount of energy to get the best result possible. By doing too much, you will actually either cause shedding or you will diminish results completely. Now also too little is not good, but you need just the right amount. And quite frankly, for 70% of the population, the iGrow is providing just the right amount. So I hope this is informative about this. Uh, if you have questions, please do not hesitate to call our clinic.